this is my new toy um, that we're gonna we're gonna hang out with today. New toy, and he has these little cookie cutter looking things, and um, they make flowers. Play with new toys. You and me, babe. You and me, babe. It's just nothing else. Oh my gosh, it feels like it's been forever. It feels like it's been forever since I've been in the studio. Uh, so, show went fantastic. Hope you loved my little, um, my little video about the show. I'm sorry there wasn't more to show you as far as the, um, the actual booth set up and all that kind of stuff, but man, did it get crazy. It got crazy fast. It was only a three hour show. So, um, you know, and it, it, uh, note to self, make sure you have enough time to set up. Um, because an hour and a half is long enough. <laughs> Oh, but man, do we have things to be grateful for. We did better this year than we did last year, which is fantastic. Um, at that same show, um, uh, there's a new heater in the garage. So I do, I am supporting, supporting the snowman look. I've got two pairs of pants on. I've got three tops on. So, um, and, uh, and the heater's on the garage. It hit 32 in Texas. Woo! Ladies and gentlemen, it does not do that very often. And so now the mosquitoes are gone. All sorts of great things to be grateful for in the pottery studio today. Um, so I uh, have decided not to throw, but to play with new toys, which is another great thing to be grateful for. So, um, oh, oh. Oh, and I talked to the people about the slab roller, and I think we're going to be able to fix it, which is fantastic. All sorts of grateful things. Has their own little individuality. Oh my gosh, they're so cute and they're gonna be so cute on my fairy houses. <laughs> It'll be great. Superman's hitting next level skills. Let me show you what he did today. <laughs> what I tell you? Seriously cool, huh? They're, they all look very much the same. They're just like dead on. Cause that's my Superman. He's amazing. He is amazing. He's amazing. He's Superman. So let me let me share the whole thing. You need about half an ounce of clay. I was measuring it at the beginning and an ounce is too much. At least for the thinness that I like. And um, and half an ounce is better than a whole ounce. And um, and then you want to flatten it. into a disc and then you want to pack that disc in cornstarch so 
And you want to get around the rim as well. You want to take your doodad. And on some of them, specifically this one right here, you want to mash it down in there real good. Then, whoop bam it doesn't release. If you don't get enough cornstarch on it. So I did not get enough cornstarch on it, but there it finally released. Isn't that great? Isn't that great? So here's what I've been thinking. I was looking in the wet box from this little guy here and I was thinking that that could go on top of that little guy and he could get him a little window and he could be a little fairy house apartment. He's not really tall enough but he would be so cute in in a little uh, in the right proportions, in the right proportions and in the right um, environment, like in a potted plant. Oh my gosh. Yes, I'll take two. And um, of course, because he's not nearly so bussy, I wouldn't have to charge as much. So that's good. That's real good, right? Everybody loves that. So let's see how this guy comes together. Just Herbert size. <laughs> oh, these are so fun. So these are little tiny ones. So these would be good for like um, plants. Like if you had a potted plant, you would definitely need a fairy house like this in your potted plant. And what, where else? Where else? Tell me, tell me where you would put him if he was yours. Um, in an 
an, an herb plant or something like that, that would be fantastic. Or hiding in a place where you wouldn't necessarily expect to see a fairy house. Like you could put him, um, you know, like next to a bird feeder or something like that, or on a, a outside on a on a on a on a bird bath or something like that. Those would be fun places. My grandmother. Um, always had birds, has still birds everywhere. Um, she has bird baths and she has bird feeders and she has bird, um, uh, all over the place bird stuff. Um, blue birds and red birds and you look out her, the window in her kitchen, and birds all the time, all the time. It was so beautiful, so much fun, so much fun. So yeah, next to your bird feeder or your bird bath outside or inside in a potted plant, or outside in a potted plant. Do you have potted plants outside? Because uh, some people, some people have those big, huge pots. One of these days, I'll have to make one of those. I'll have to have a bigger kiln, though. <laughs> I love you. You're the best. You're the cutest little thing. Yes, you are. Alrighty. <laughs> and of course, if we fix hours, then I will make a video about fixing it. I can't promise that, so I cross promise. I got, I gotta go feed Superman some dinner. He, he needs to eat.